wool. Just got it in yesterday. Really, really excited. I left it in the little bag so you guys could see. Um, I'm not going to show you the other side because I don't want you guys to know my address. Um, but here it is. I'm so excited to finally open it up all the way from the beginning for you guys. Let's get this going. The bag inside itself feels smaller this time. Oh, and there's everything in the bag. Um, the little pamphlet is going to have us making a pouch this time. How cute! Those that knit, this is what yours will look like. And crochet is this one. I wonder what color yarn we're going to get. Oh, and they did little shamrocks this month because of St. Patty's being really, really close. Okay, let's look inside. And... Oh, the little card that explains what yarn and who picked it out and your code for the free pattern and also so it looks like we got four again this month which means only 15 yards her little skein that they send. Oops. Come out. It didn't stay together. So four skeins and they're kind of in autumn colors. Um, an orange, cream, like a tan, and then a, like a really light brown. Um, inside we also got some really good goodies this time. Oh, this time it was Hand Wound with Love. I don't know if you can see that. From Gus. Thank you, Gus. But, oh, I am so excited because I almost purchased some of these last night. Stitch markers and a whole bunch of them. I got a sealed bag full of them. But there's a hole... I'm excited. I'm doing a beanie right now that someone requested of me and I needed stitch markers and I have no clue where I put mine. But a lot of stitch markers. And another soak came in. I'm really enjoying these. Um, I haven't used one yet, but I'm really glad I have them because I'm always afraid to use my laundry soap on my crocheted items. But wow, I'm impressed with all these stitch markers. I mean, there's so many. I just, I can't believe it. So many. I love it. Love, love, love it. Okay, on to the yarn to figure out what kind it is and all that fun stuff. This one is a rougher texture. Um, try to block out some of the light. But it's all really pretty yarn. It's called Swan's Island All-American Sport 100% USA Rambulette and Honey. Oh, we got 20 yards this time. Normally when we get four of these, we only get 15 yards each. This time we got 20. Well, at least in this color we got 20. I'm impressed. And that's not bad for $10. Got all of this for $10. That includes shipping. This one's softer. It feels more silkier um, than this one. This one's got a real rough 
texture to it, almost kind of like the Red Heart. Um, but this one feels more like baby soft. It's called Cascade Longwood Sport 46 Cream is the color. 100% superwash, extra fine merino wool. And it's 20 yards. I am so impressed at the whole 20 yards. Every time I've gotten these before, in the four pack instead of three, they've always been 15 yards, not 20. This one is, um, texture wise, is a mix between these two. Um, it feels thicker like this one, but soft like this one. And the color on this one, and the name of it is Mandolin Tosh, Tosh Sport. I hope I'm saying that right. I'm really sorry, Jimmy Bean, if I ain't. Um, and Daffodil. It's 100% Superwash Merino Wool in 20 yards. Again, oh, wow, I'm just flabbergasted that we got 20 yards each this time. I'm so thankful. Thank you, Jimmy Bean. And then this one, I really actually like this color, the orange color. Um, I can imagine making little pumpkins to decorate my house in this. And this one is Heiko Su Suino. I hope that's right. Oh, I'm, I so probably slaughtered that. Um, it's in cantaloupe. It's 80% superwash merino, 20% bamboo, viscose, and it's also in 20 yards. I really like this one. I like the color. I like the feel of the cream. And these two feel like the cream as well, but I really like this color. Really, really, really like it. If you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and comment and remember that I do not receive anything from the company. This is all my opinion and only my opinion. I pay for this out of pocket and I really hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and I can't wait to